Hello everyone, today I want to show you how to make homemade pizza with Prigo Italian sauce. Homemade dough and homemade pizza meat. Mayang adlaw, mayang gabi, kaninyong tanan, tara maghimutag pizza. Eternity here, happiness is homemade. Welcome to my channel. These are the ingredients needed to cook the meat. On a preheated pan in medium heat, add olive oil, saute garlic, onion, bell pepper, saute until you can smell the aroma. Remove from the pan and set aside. In the same pan, let's brown the meat. Leave little chunks of the meat. And drain most of the liquid. In the same pan, add a sauteed garlic, onion, and bell pepper. Add ground black pepper. Italian seasoning. Bolognese beef cube. A little beef broth. Stir, make sure the beef cube is dissolved. Transfer it to a bowl and let it cool down and set aside. These are the ingredients needed for making the quick and easy pizza dough. You need one cup lukewarm water around 110 degrees Fahrenheit or 45 degrees Celsius. In a clean bowl, add the lukewarm water, one teaspoon brown sugar, stir until it's completely dissolved. Add one pack active dry yeast, 3 fourth ounces or 21 grams. Stir a little bit. Put it in a warm area until it starts to foam around 10 minutes. Make sure the yeast is alive. If the yeast did not bubble up like this, your yeast is dead. Try again. Don't use it. Prepare a large mixing bowl. Add a little olive oil and spread it out. Add two and one half cups all-purpose flour. One half teaspoon salt. Mix properly until it's well combined. Add the yeast mixture into the flour mixture. Add two tablespoons olive oil. Stir with spatula or wooden spoon until the dough starts to form. Continue kneading by hand until the pizza dough comes together like a ball. Like the flour, a clean surface. Knead with both hands for about 5 minutes or until it's firm and stretchy. And just have fun. And then cover it for about 5 minutes. Remember, this is quick and easy pizza dough. Then knead for about few minutes and your pizza dough is ready.
divide it into two. This recipe yields around two thin pizza crust. Save the other half and cover it and set it aside. Now let's start forming the crust. I'm not a pro, so bear with me. Lightly flour the surface again, and then get a rolling pin and have fun making the crust. And it's done! Get your pizza pan and then stretch it out. And just try to flatten the dough or form the sides like a plate. It will catch the sauce. Wrap some olive oil On a preheated oven at 450 degrees Fahrenheit or 232 degrees Celsius, cook for about 5 to 6 minutes. Oh, and don't forget to poke the crust with fork. And don't overcook it. You still need to cook it later. It'll cool down a little bit. These are the ingredients for the toppings. You can use any toppings that you like. Prego Italian sauce and it's my favorite. Time to assemble the pizza. Add pizza sauce at the top of the dough. Spread it out. Add grated mozzarella cheese. Sharp cheddar cheese. Parmesan cheese Cooked meat Mushrooms Jalapeno Olives. You can use the chop or the whole olives if you want. Bell pepper. Onion. Pineapple chunks. It's optional. Mozzarella cheese Parmesan cheese A little cheddar cheese And you can add more cheese if you want And it's ready Ready to bake In a preheated oven at 450 degrees Fahrenheit Or 232 degrees Celsius Cook for 10 minutes or longer if you want. Watch it closely. Every oven is different. Watch your pizza. It looks pretty good. Pull it out from the oven. Cool it down for a few minutes before slicing. Time to slice. It's so much fun making your own pizza, and I hope you'll try it too. It looks good and colorful. 
It's so good and I think it's better than takeout. Thank you for watching everyone. Have a good day or have a good evening. Thank you once again. I really do appreciate your time. I hope to see you in my next video. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.